So this is the way I animate. This doesn't mean you have to animate this way. Again, I'm not trying to change the way you animate. I'm trying to show you how to animate creatures. The way I usually animate is I usually set up five keys okay, for blocking. And really, them, really only three of them are unique. Actually, two of them are unique. No, actually, three of them are unique. I'm right. So one and 35 are exactly the same. Right? Makes sense. 18 and 1 are exactly the same also, but it's just reversed. Makes sense. 10 and 27 are the middle of what's happening between 18 and 1. Okay? Why do I animate this way? I'll show you why. I try to separate my keys as far as possible when I'm blocking. I like to... I like to give Maya a chance to uh, show me what it's got in the middle. All right. So which means that all these keys from here to here in between, these are all free. These are everything that Maya is trying to show you. Um, you know, obviously you're guiding it with these two keys here and it's going to interpel, you know, interpret it. Ah, it's trying to show you what it's got in the middle. Um, and then I'll keep showing it how to animate or what I really need in between these frames. All right. It also avoids me having little pops in, in interpolate. That's the word I was looking for. Jesus. I was like, oh, it's a mouthful. Um, also, it avoids me having little pops, little things that I might have to clean later. So I try to get it as smooth as possible first. All the little like weight shifts that I'm, I was talking about with the hips, that comes later. All right, 